So real quick in this video, I'm going to show you all of the locker and safe combinations in Resident Evil 2. I'm not going to be showing how to unlock each section of the police station to get to these places or any other place that I'm showing, but if you want to see more Resident Evil 2 guides or specific things that you're stuck on or something like that, just leave it down in the comments and I'll try to make a video on it. Usually people down in the comments are pretty helpful as well. Okay, so starting with the main hall in the police station, we're going to get the safe over towards the right of the main hall since there's only one on this side of the map. So head over here to the waiting room, which can be found on the second floor, and there will be a safe over here in the corner. And for the combination, some people get confused when you say left or right on these. When I say right, I'm talking about clockwise. When I say left, I'm talking about counterclockwise. So go left until you get to the six, then go back to the right and go to the number two, and then go back to the left and then go to the number 11. So left six, right two, left 11. You should get a muzzle break for your pistol. So as soon as you enter the west office, you'll come to Leon's desk. There are two locks on it. The left one's code is NED, N-E-D, and the right one's code is M-R-G. You'll find an extended mag for your pistol. Now still in the west office. If you go just past the desk, on the left side you'll find a safe over here in this little office space over here. The combination is 9 right, 15 left, 7 right. So rotate it to the right or clockwise until you get to the 9, then reverse and go to the 15, then reverse again and go to 7. So now we're headed over here towards the stairs and go to the second floor and you'll find a locker. The code is CAP, C-A-P. You'll find some shotgun shells in here, not much in there at all. Now go up one floor onto the third floor and there will be another locker. The code is DCM. You'll find some ammo in here as well for the deagle. Now I think that's all of the unlockable stuff from the police station. Next we'll be going to a different section of the game, so if you don't want to see that, click off of the video now. Okay, so now we're here in the sewers a bit later on in the game, and eventually you'll get to the sewer control room, and there will be a locker. The combination is SZF. And just a little bit after that, you'll enter the sewers treatment pool, and there will be a safe along the wall on a table. The combo is two left, 12 right, 8 left. Okay, so now we're going to go again to a different location of the map. So like I said, click off of the video if you don't want spoilers. And now we're here at the greenhouse, more specifically the greenhouse control room. Now I'm pretty sure you actually need these to progress through the game. These aren't like actual things like the rest of the stuff we've unlocked so far. So the first code we enter is going to be these symbols here, and it should open up the ladder in the greenhouse, which will be displayed up on the map above us. But also while you're up here, type in this code here, which will unlock the drug testing lab. And you don't have to put in the second code yet because you actually don't get this second code until you go down the ladder that we just unlocked. Once you go down that ladder, you'll find a little statue thing. If you inspect that statue and look at the very bottom, that is how you get this second code. But if you want to put in the code early, you can go ahead and put it in early. It just might confuse you a little bit. But that's pretty much it, guys. I would also show you the drug testing lab little puzzle for the room that we just unlocked in the drug testing lab. But if I'm being completely honest, I don't even know what I did here. I was trying to figure it out and I accidentally solved it. But basically, you just want to get all of the juice to the one bottle's right line. I would tell you like exactly which order to press everything and how to get it exactly how I got it, but all I can do is just let the gameplay just go on so you can see in case one of you guys are stuck on that. And for the portable safes, a lot of people were asking about this also. I can't just give you the code for these because they're different for everyone, but for those you just want to memorize the light on each button or write them down and then go in the order following the arrows beside each light. I'm not sure if they all go counterclockwise, but mine did. Just follow the arrows. You just want to start with any light and go in order from the next light light beside the one you just lit up. But I think that's it. Don't forget to leave a like on the video if you want to see more Resident Evil 2 videos. See ya!